Wow, wow, wow. Welcome back, fellow YouTubers. We're back with Heavenly Sword. Uh, G Team here presented it to you. We're finally going to beat this bitch who's talking all this shit. She has a big ass mouth. Plus, she kind of beat our father to death. She's tricky. Now, I don't know. This game is pretty cool. I keep saying that, but I, I really mean it. I was hoping they would make a part two of this shit. And I actually did hear that they were going to make a part two of it, but they canceled it to make something else, which it hurts my heart. But she's going to be in a... In um Fuck. The Battle Royale at PlayStation... Smash Brothers wanna be. I'm actually really excited for that game. That game should be very unique. It looks a bit cheesy, but what doesn't at first, you know? This big ass sword. Nah, but I don't know how keen you guys are on philosophy or ethics or anything but I've been looking at this video blog recently and it's really caught my eye um this guy's name is Stefan Molyneux I have no idea where that he's from he's, one source says he's from Canada the next thing I know he's from America and he says he was in England for a while so I don't know where the fuck he's from but uh he's a pretty smart guy he, he does uh, excuse me there's a couple of podcasts about philosophy and he pretty much just goes through um, ethics and philosophy and then he ties it into politics and it's really eye-opening um, once when this which is beating my ass it's really obvious once you are handheld by somebody to um, follow the rules of morality it becomes apparently obvious uh, that politics is pretty bad. And you're, 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 you're listening to me and you're like, what the fuck? How could you say politics is bad? Politics is you know, several laws and all that. And then uh, help people. Or not the politics, the government. The government is pretty bad. Um, so yeah, you might be like, you know, what the fuck do you mean the government is bad? The government gives us laws, they pay people. They, uh, they pay people to protect us and the teachers. But um, I highly suggest that you watch some of his videos. This is uh, YouTube slash user slash Stepbot, I believe. And he has a couple of podcasts. Uh, they're like his first videos. He just talks about, he just breaks down what morality is. Um, uh, he breaks down morality. And he, then he connects it to uh, ideas and ethics, and finally politics, and you come to see that you know, politics in America are pretty corrupt, and it's not exactly, it's not exactly, um, all perfume and roses, so, if you're kind of questioning whether some of the activities of the government lately have been moral or whether the government the government even has the power to do what they're doing you should probably you should pretty much check them out his theory basically goes that the government is full of people right it's full of people what is the government if you really consider the question you realize there's the government is nothing. The government is an idea. It's, that's all it is. And there's... What is it... What exactly is it about the government that... Well, I'll let you watch this. If it loads... Dun, dun, dun. Here you go. genius. <laughs> I mean, you wouldn't catch me rushing back to rescue my father, the crusty old pervert. <sighs> Whipty, you look terribly green around the gills. I cannot 
fear my legs. I die for you. Let me feel them for you. Oh, oh honey. Yes, my dear. I'm scared. I needed you, but you left me. You're part of me now. And I'm part of you. <laughs> Do not abandon me. Not now, I need you the most. This game is so awesome, man. I love the storytelling. It's just unique. <clears throat> Plus, Noriko is hot. She might be the typical uh, scantily clad female warrior, but she's a hot typical. And she's independent. She's pretty strong. I feel like she could beat me in arm wrestling. Valiantly to shed blood for a worthless cause, perhaps. Well, whatever it is, it's over. Mariko, let's start again. Try to get to know each other a little bit better, hey? I mean, you're actually quite pretty, you know, and I think life's all about having fun. What do you say? I'm going to kill you. And I'm going to kill that walking flesh bag son of yours. Oh, very interesting. But you see, the sword is mine now, and it is residing safely in my armory with all my other trinkets. <laughs> <laughs> Roach, bring her to the pit. It's time for a little celebration. <laughs> Looks like we're in trouble. It looks like you're in trouble, Sonny. Yeah. So obviously you can see we're not going to play with Nariko. We're going to play with her annoying friend Kai. Ah, oh, I hate Kai so much. But, alas, we do what we must. Not what we want. Look at her knees. They're so red. That's not why I don't like her, by the way. Totally not judging her for her knees. Why'd you leave Kai alone, Noriko? Here we go. <laughs> you know Kai likes to jump. We come across the first reason why I freaking hate Kai. And that is her bow and arrow. Word crossbow. What? I thought I got him. Whoa! Alright, here we go. Oh, and his fucking ear. Oh, and his ear too. Jesus. Yuck. It's one hell of a story to tell to your doctor. <laughs> right in his fucking collarbone. I don't even know how that went through him. Oh, 
bullseye. <laughs> oh, and his nose. Yo, I need thumbs up just for these shots. These shots are epic. Ah, guys are ruining my record. Ooh, it's like a left testicle shot. Oh, this guy is so lucky. Just did a matrix on me. And I killed that pot. Oh. Yeah. Just accept it. Just let it be. Just let it be, baby. Damn. Shot him in both of his titties. He's man babes. They called man babes, Garrett, I know. Ah, drinking some nice Minimade or Tropicana, I can't remember which one. I'm black, so it's great. Not just failing left and right here. I was definitely not made to be an archer. I was made to be in the fray, just fighting. Cause this shit is kind of frozen, mate. Just checking for pots, guys. That's all I'm doing. Guy's suffering. Suffering for his transgressions. Transgressions? Transgressions? Whatever he did, he's, he's dead. I hate this room. But I love the game. with this fucking crossbow, man. There you go. Shot him in his bicep and he gave up. So fuck it. I don't want to do this anymore. I quit. You didn't tell me I was going to get shot in my bicep. My like bicep. These pots, man. These fucking pots, man. Guys are ready to rape me. Ugh. Hate this crossbow. It's a definite game of cat and mouse here. Hey, score ten. Yo, these guys are. Gotcha. Come on, get the pot. Get the get the pot. There you go. Damn, that guy 
Wanted to be drawn like one of his French girls. Did you see that? Or one of my French girls. Draw me like one of your French girls. New artwork unlocked. It's not. Let's we'll switch somewhere. Um. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Take all that. This arrow sounds so painful. the voiceovers who do these pain voices I'm gonna ask them how do you what, what do you get your inspiration from because how do you know what constitutes a pain noise or a pain grunt I'm like I don't know I kicked my balls It seems like we're just gonna crack this open and um yeah that's the video guys hope you enjoy subscribe rate comment let me know uh i don't know just just fucking subscribe bitches peace